So we're going to talk about why cod liver oil can help someone with eczema. Now, what is this skin condition? It's a condition where you have this red, scaly, flaky rash on your skin. It's another name for this condition being atopic dermatitis. And then you have psoriasis, which is in the same family. They're all related. But let's talk about why cod liver oil is one of the best remedies for pretty much any skin problem you have. Fish oils are high in omega-3 fatty acids. We're talking about DHA and EPA. But cod liver oil has two additional things, vitamin A and vitamin D. So if we start with vitamin A deficiencies, one of the symptoms is follicular hyperkeratosis. Now, what is that? That's a condition where you have these little red or brown dots by your hair follicles. It could be on your arm or your back. And let me just flash a picture up so you can see what that looks like. I just want to show you the relationship between a vitamin A deficiency and what it can do for your skin. There's another condition called xerosis. It looks like a very dried out skin appearance with these little wrinkles around these scales. Vitamin A has everything to do with skin integrity. And then we get vitamin D. Now psoriasis has this appearance as well with some more placking, but psoriasis is an autoimmune condition. And vitamin D is the best remedy for any autoimmune condition. Now, why? Because vitamin D is an anti-inflammatory. It acts like cortisol in the body without the side effects. And cortisol is an anti-inflammatory. It's used in a lot of skin issues. Vitamin D in higher amounts is really good for psoriasis and pretty much any type of dermatitis, including this right here, atopic dermatitis, which basically is eczema right there. Cod liver oil has vitamin A and vitamin D. And cod liver oil has omega-3 fatty acids, DHA and EPA. These are part of essential fatty acids. And if you look up essential fatty acid deficiency, guess what one of the big symptoms is? Dermatitis, which is scaly, dry skin. By taking cod liver oil, you have the combination of omega-3, DHA and EPA. You have vitamin D and vitamin A all in one. If you're going to take cod liver oil, it's very, very important to reduce your omega-6 fatty acids. If you're not familiar with what these are, I put a link down below. But it's merely a matter of increasing the omega-3 and decreasing the omega-6 for your skin. And I want to bring up one point about a lot of people that do keto. They focus on these fats right here, coconut oil and butter in their diet and cooking, which is great and hopefully they're reducing the other oils, even safflower oil or sunflower oil and the other cooking oils. But here's the thing, coconut oil has zero omega-3 fatty acids and butter has only tiny, tiny traces of omega-3 fatty acids. So you're not gonna get your omega-3 from coconut or butter. You're gonna have to get it from fish, sardines, like salmon or just cod liver oil. And lastly, I put a little information about cod liver oil down below. Check it out. Hey, we're back. With another amazing recipe. No grains, no sugar, totally keto. There's no suffering in keto. Absolutely not, Karen. And it's an immune system builder. Absolutely. You have to check this out. I think you should hurry up, watch the recipe, and make it yourself. It's just so easy to be keto. But is it simple? It's super simple. We hope you enjoy making it as much as we are enjoying eating it.